Hello, this is Margaret from Wasin. Uh, this is Margaret from Diani Beach. Uh, I'm just uh, saying a, a quick hello and wishing you well. Remember to subscribe to our channel. Remember to to post your comment whenever we post a new video, and to continue liking us as we wait to keep to update our website on YouTube. We are grateful that you've been following us. We are grateful that some of you have been sending us their honest feedback. We are here to inform you. We are here to encourage, to walk this journey together and we are here to educate you on what is happening around the globe and especially during this time of COVID-19 pandemic. It has uh, slowed down businesses along Diani Beach, and, but that uh, doesn't mean that uh, the hotels have actually closed down. They are still, they remain operational, but the only difference is that they are not getting so many uh, visitors for now. But you are being told in the month of October, uh, a lot of people have started booking uh, from overseas. And in the month of October, a lot of guests are expected here. You know, we are headed to December. And December is when uh, a lot of visitors come visiting this place. So they'll be able to, uh, they'll be able, they, right now they are trying to contain the situation. But they, with time, if this is to happen, and I believe it to happen, they'll, they'll be able to compensate for the lost in card during this time when they, they had a low season, with, during this time when not a lot of guests checked into this place. One thing I like about Diani, it is not populated, uh, just a few people. The beaches are very clean, the water is clean, and uh, it's also very safe to walk uh, uh, along the beach, whether it is during the day or in the evening, in the morning. We normally come jogging all the way to this place. So we are not staying far from here. And we have always enjoyed coming to the beach. We have always enjoyed taking a, a walk along the beach and also meeting new people, uh, discussing about our cultural differences and uh, maybe issues to do with uh, our nature, mother nature. And it, it, I still, I'm still emphasizing on the idea of us protecting our nature. It is our responsibilities as human beings to protect the nature. It is our responsibilities as human beings to protect our ozone layer. It is our responsibilities as human beings to protect our lakes, uh, rivers, oceans. It is our responsibility. It's our responsibility to take care of our forest, the green cover. It is our responsibility to take care of the mangrove, which grows along the coastal line. It is our responsibility to protect the coral leaf, which grows along this place. It is our responsibility. And when we become so inhuman, we become so irresponsi irresponsible, we go destroying them, time time will tell when the nature starts fighting back. It will come a time when we'll have nothing to show our generation. We will have nothing to show our generation regarding our, 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 our animals, especially the big five. We'll have nothing to show our generation regarding the sea turtles, the dollfish, the, the, the sharks. We'll have nothing to show our generation regarding the coral leaf which are found uh, along the coastal line, even in the deep waters. We'll have nothing to show for and to teach our generation. We are being told whatever we do here, we shouldn't interfere with, the way, with, with our ecosystem because if we happen, if we do so, a time will come when we will wish we never did. So I'm urging you from Diani that uh, it is our responsibility to protect our nature. It's our resp responsibility to sensitize our fellow Kenyans regarding the benefit of protecting our, our nature. And when we do this, we shall be grateful that we did it. 
Remember, I will always urge and keep on reminding you regarding uh, not we, 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 we deter, we, we, we avoid coming with plastic water bottles to this place. We avoid uh, using plastic containers when we go buying uh, our takeaway food uh, to this place. We avoid all these things because when you do this, we are destroying our, our turtles, you are destroying fish because they will go feeding on them, they get choked, they, they die, and uh, we end up becoming the end consumer of this, of this, of, uh, of this uh, seafoods, the, the fish, and it will also have uh, health imp implications on us as human beings. God bless you, and from here it's bye-bye till we meet again. Bye-bye, see you.